guys, GG Views for Gamers here, filming the final pickup video of the day. It's been a crazy day. So, uh, Toys R Us was having a special sale one day only today. Always buy one, get one free on all 1099 Amazing Spider Man 2 Spider Strike figures. So, I did just that. This is the one I actually paid for. It's Iron Claw Spider Man. Uh, it's kind of cool. I like the whole uh, red and white aesthetic. Very Canadian with the blue accents. You know, could be French Spider Man too. I don't know. And it's cool to have him like have this backpack sneak the sneak attack spider claws. That's really cool. Uh, still, again, haven't seen the movie, but hoping it's better than the god awful first one. I never want to see that movie again as long as I live. And we have what is this Blitzboard Spider Man? With, like this insect attacking board that has a magnet in it apparently. Look at that, Spidey's channeling Marty McFly from Back to the Future 2. Speaking of which, um, scientists of the world, you got seven months. Let's see some hoverboards. Make it happen. And, uh, my friend was DJing at the Forge Place Mall. He brought the house down. He should have, like, the skylight should have just shattered, but that would have probably killed a whole bunch of people below. Because <laughs> that glass is sharp and plentiful. So that's a good thing. But uh, before I made it down to his events, which was at 2.30 today, I went to the Bucker 2 and picked up a couple knockoff Transformers. Uh, they have them there all the time, and they're fantastic. They're actually really funny figures. Uh, so this is a knockoff version of Animated Thundercracker from, uh, I think, 2009? I don't, know how the, I don't know how these companies get a hold of these molds from Hasbro, or, someone, or like someone's an informant inside Hasbro, but either way, I'm happy. And this is a bootleg of... Uh, 2008 Universe Cosmos. Uh, I finally have a Cosmos figure. <laughs> it's pretty funny. They just released one, actually, in the Generations line. It's pretty good. Uh, you should go check it out. Support Hasbro. Uh, but I like to support the little guys, too. Alright, I'm my pirate. Oh, they're talking about Ninja Turtles on TMZ. I'm sorry. The only reason I'm watching TMZ is because there's nothing else on at 6 o'clock on a Saturday. And uh, I stopped over at Hidden City, uh, and today was free comic book day as well. They had the Mandalorians there, and Deadpool was showing up, and everybody was, like, super having a good time. There were kids there and stuff, and, every like, parents were bringing their children, and families were getting together, and people were... There were artists signing their work, and sketches being given away. I wish I had the money at the time to get them, because there was this really beautiful Frozen sketch someone did. Wish I could get it. Oh, well. Maybe there'll be a Comic-Con. Maybe I can buy it from them then. Or some other show in the city. Uh, but I got this. It was free, obviously. It's the all-new Mighty Morphin Power Rangers. Uh, from Paper Cuts. And it actually is a legitimate Power Rangers comic. It's a new Power Rangers comic. It's got everything you could ever want. It's got profiles of the Rangers. For some reason, Tommy is having the Green Ranger when he's... Actually, the White Ranger in this comic, you got Jason there. You got every bo every 90s boy's crush, Kimberly. My personal favorite ranger, Billy, the Blue Ranger. Who's my favorite color? You got uh, uh, Trini, rest in peace, Dewey Trang. You were the Yellow Ranger for me. And my other favorite ranger, Zack, the Black Ranger. Zack attack is back. My older brother, my oldest brother is named Zack, so. <laughs> and uh, apparently he looked up to Zack Morris as a child. I'm not making any of this up to be funny. And you even have a profile of the real heroes of Power Rangers, Bulk and Skull. They saved a lot of mediocre episodes during the series. Not that the series itself is mediocre, but, you know, it, it, it had, you know. I haven't read, I briefly skimmed through this, and from the looks of it, it's vintage Power Rangers. It's silly, it's cheesy, it's funny, you got the Megazord fight, the monsters, Lord Zed, Rita Repulsa. You know what? I, I can't argue with it. I love Power Rangers, I really do. And I'm hoping to get more Power Rangers toys here in the next little while. So, uh, hope you guys enjoyed all these pickup videos that I've been shooting back to back to back. Oh boy. And uh, now I know how the thrift stores feel. <laughs> Shout out to the thrift stores and Beardman and my good buddy 64-bit Matthew. Thanks for that uh, Bill and Ted game, you guys. I'm serious, it really is fun. If you don't know what I'm talking about, go watch the Retro Gamers Unite pickup video. Looking forward to Retro Gamers Unite 2! So, I'll see you guys next time. Until then, it's Morphin' Time!